Hi, this is CS Trades Wolfpack. How are you all doing today? So I just wanted to start off. Thank you for joining me here today. Um, I just wanted to, if, if you're not, uh, uh, if you've never seen our content before, um, we specialize in stock squeeze plays. <clears throat> um, we are ranked number one amongst community, um, mostly on YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, and Reddit as stock squeeze specialists. Um, we uh, have a whole bunch of uh, specialized tools to make you more money, um, give you more opportunity to uh, see the plays coming, beginning and ending. Um, and um, yeah, the, the sky's the limit. Um, everybody's welcome to join us. Um, we will jump on in here. And um, I'm gonna get into today's options and puts D trading, the CS Trades Wolfpack style. So, um, CS Alpha Wolf. Options are not as good as they say they are. So I wanted to get into that. There's a lot of uh, controversy going around right now on YouTube and these social media platforms. Um, a lot of it is uh, just to do with con creator content, um, just to get uh, making money off these uh, monetization um, uh, ta tactics. Um, so we pulled that out of the equation and we're just dealing with the hardcore facts. It's not good, okay? Um, there's a reason why that they've been pushing on this. Um, and I, I just want to get this out here because if we, if everybody switched and, and a majority of three quarters of the people started doing this, it would jeopardize our squeeze play. Okay. I'm going to be very clear on that. Okay. Um, I've been working on this for about a week now. Um, and I've found some good stuff. Okay. <clears throat> and some of it, I will only be able to share it on our private server. And if you come to the channel, um, I'm live six o'clock Pacific standard time week, uh, five days a week. Just come and ask me and in the private server, um, I will be disclosing more personal information. It's just there's certain stuff that can't be shared on YouTube because it's damning information against the hedge funds. OK, so um, <clears throat> options are not as good as they uh, they say they are. Um, if you're out of them, you are just giving the shares back to the hedge funds. F or uh, WTF <clears throat> abbreviation. All right. So. To start off, I'm not getting into the whole, oh my God, put, puts are evil. And I did get this off of us, uh, off of another platform, but I've put my own words into it too, just so um, I'm very clear on that kind of stuff. Um, I, I, I like the way the format was written, but I put more information into it. It was a little bit, uh, it, it needed more information, some more factual DD. Okay, so um, uh, argument because at the end of the day, uh, they're a financial tool, neutral, and with a lot of potential to cause harm if misused. That is 100% correct. So we are, uh, so we are crystal clear. I'm not getting into the whole. It's not going to end the squeeze play. Okay, potentially, um, if we do not um, take action. Um, so blast this out. This needs to get out there, my friends. Um, it's the least we can do. Okay, and I'll be hammering on this. Um, that being said, I uh, think I know why hedgies are pushing us to buy puts. First, understanding that wh when a put option is sold, it's exactly being created. Then, then the, the use it written because the contract must be written. You guys hear that all the time in ladies, right? Um, the buy of the put um, option has the right to sell the X amount of shares at the strike price um, IF and put option is in the money. In the money means the strike price is higher than the share price. So um, the, if AMC is trading at 20 and the put is at 30 strike price, those puts are in the money. Still with me? You understand? Okay. Options are not as good as they say they are. It's just giving the hedge funds back their shares, which is not good at all. Okay. Now, when puts are expired, they, they're they like calls. Anything in the money is is automatically exercised. So if you have a, a thousand shares of AMC, right? You could buy 10 puts on the contract. One contract covers a hundred shares. So 10 contracts would cover a thousand shares. See, pretty, uh, I brought this right down so um, everybody can understand it because it's really complex. Uh, to the hedge funds against a dip, okay? Um, but if those puts expire in the money, the shares will automatically be sold at a strike price. So that's what they're, that's what everything's missing out of the puzzle. Not the market price, the strike price. Okay. So I just want you to know that. And guess who is doing the buying? 
hedge funds. If the hedge funds are selling uh, puts on options, uh, putting exp uh, expiring in the money, hedge funds get to buy those shares back from us at strike price. NFA, but please know that what you're doing before you dive in. Just know what you're doing, okay, my friends? You're not helping at all. It's actually screwing us, okay? Um, and this is it. This is this is the only way it goes, okay? Take it for what it is. I love you all, and you have a great day. Bye.